Welcome back, outdoor enthusiasts. We're just at shopguy.com, and today we are in the outdoors. In this video, two spotting scope brands will be going head to head. We have the Athlon Optics Spotting Scope and the Celestron Spotting Scope. Spotting scopes are a must have for wildlife watchers, sports fans, and even stargazers. Boasting high magnifications while sporting a compact profile, these spotting scopes are basically the combination of the monocular and a telescope. For those of you who want to get a crystal clear view of the distance, our team at TrustedShoppingGuy.com has gathered two of the best in our list. Battling it out on today's brand wars, we have the Athlon Optics Spotting Scope going against the Celestron Spotting Scope. Both these scopes have earned a 5 badge rating from our team here at TrustedShoppingGuy.com. Be sure to watch until the end so that you can determine which spotting scope proves to be the most reliable companion in the field of long distance viewing. If you're interested in the other spotting scopes that we reviewed, do check out our spotting scope review video link below. If you want direct links to the products themselves, all these links are also listed below too. So without further ado, let's start the brand wars. The first category that these spotting scopes will be going toe to toe with would be their magnification power. Spotting scopes are medium range telescopes with a magnification power ranging from 15 to 60 times magnification. They usually have an interchangeable fixed length eyepiece or a single zoom eyepiece to change the magnification power. If you're scanning an area, it would be best to start using a low power eyepiece or the lowest setting on a zoom eyepiece. In this category, both Athlon and Celestron have 20 to 60 times magnification, which is in the ideal range for a spotting scope. With both scopes having identical features, there are no other option but to end this round in a tie. The second category that these two brands will be going toe to toe with would be their objective lens diameter. The objective lens functions to gather light, with it being located at the front of the scope. The larger the diameter of the objective lens, the more light is admitted into the scope, which results in a brighter image. Once again, Athlon and Celestron have similar features, with both of them boasting an 80mm objective lens. This delivers just the right amount of light for optimal viewing even at night. Given the facts, this is clearly another round that results in a tie. The third category that these two brands will be going toe to toe with would be their waterproof and fogproof features. The best spotting scopes are designed to completely exclude water from the optical tube. They can also be nitrogen purged, which means they are filled with dry, inert gas to prevent internal fogging. Do note, however, that waterproofing doesn't mean that you can submerge it in water. If that happens, water can seep in and cause damage. Athlon is waterproof and is highly resistant to extreme weather conditions and accidental submersion in water. It's also nitrogen purged and provides excellent fogproof protection. On the flip side, Celestron is both waterproof and fogproof. We'll be able to use this in the rainous conditions while it's also filled with nitrogen gas and sealed, keeping you from worrying about internal fogging of the lenses. Once again, this is yet another category wherein both of our scopes have identical features. With the facts straight, we'll be giving each of our competitors a point in this round. The fourth category that these two brands will be going toe to toe with would be their exit pupil diameter. Only the light rays that pass through the virtual aperture can exit the system and enter your eyes. This means that the larger the exit pupil diameter, the more light is delivered to your eye. A large exit pupil is also favored as it's more forgiving and allows for more movement while keeping the subject in view. On top of that, the larger exit pupil is also a ideal choice for night viewing. Athlon features an exit pupil diameter of 3.3 to 1.22 millimeters. Its competitor, Celestron, features an exit pupil diameter of 4.0 to 1.3 millimeters. Celestron has the upper hand in this category due to its larger diameter size. With the larger exit pupil having all the advantages, Celestron wins this round, finally breaking the tight score. The fifth category that these two brands will be going toe to toe with would be their minimum focus distance. The minimum focus distance is the range from which you can view a subject clearly. Once you get too close to the subject and exceed the minimum, the subject will be out of focus permanently. With most spotting scopes, the closest focusing distance is less than 32 feet. Athlon is a minimum focus distance of 19.7 feet, which is short by any standard. Meanwhile, Celestron has a minimum focus distance of 26.2 feet, which isn't too far behind the maximum range. The numbers are as clear as day, and Athlon has the shorter minimum focusing distance. This is why we will be given the point to Athlon in this round. The sixth category that these two brands will be going toe to toe with would be their linear field of view. The linear field of view is the width of the area you'll be able to see at a distance. In this category, bigger means better, so we suggest getting the spotting scope with larger linear field of view. Athlon has a linear field of view of 102 to 48 feet at 1,000 yards. 
Celestia, on the other hand, has a linear field of view of 105 to 53 feet at 1,000 yards. Celestia has overpowered the competition by just a bit, which is why we'll be giving them the point in this category. The seventh and final category that these two brands will be going toe-to-toe -to -toe with would be their lens coating. The Spotting Scopes lens coating is capable of improving the performance, longevity, durability, and appearance of your lenses. It is also worth noting that the coating protects both the eyes and the lenses. We highly suggest getting multi-coated lens binoculars for maximum eye comfort and protection. Athlon features fully multi-coated lenses that deliver remarkable light transmission and a bright image at any magnification setting. Meanwhile, Celestron also features multi-coated optics. Each lens is coated multiple times with anti-reflective coatings for maximum brightness, color, and contrast. This allows you to see brighter and sharper images even in dim surroundings. We have yet another round wherein these two spotting scopes have virtually identical features. With both of them equipped with multi-coated lenses, we'll be ending the seventh and final round in a tie. That was a neck-and-neck -neck battle between our two finest spotting scopes. However, only one will emerge victorious. The Athlon Optics spotting scope has scored a total of five points, with its strongest feature being its short minimum focus distance. On the other hand, Celestron was able to garner a total of six points, with its strongest features being its larger linear field of view as well as its superior exit pupil diameter size. With Celestron being ahead of the game but just a single point, they'll not be coming home empty-handed, snagging the crown in today's brand wars. And there you have it, folks. The battle between the Athlon Optics Spotting Scope and the Celestron Spotting Scope has finally ended. If you have any contenders for a next Spotting Scope face-off, which you would like our team to test, do drop it in the comments section below and we'll be sure to assess them for a next update. If you liked this video and it helped you in any way, please do give it a like and hit the subscribe button so that you can stay connected and updated with all of our research into everything that makes our outdoors great. We look forward to seeing you at the trustedshoppingguide.com again soon.